I hear you like to judge people. Oh, I know. I make fun of the celebrities, the different people. And people always say to me, you know, Warren, you should never judge another person until you've walked a mile in their shoes. You've heard that line of crap, right? <laughs> yeah. Well, let me tell all of you here something. I'm the daughter of a New York City garbage man. I have walked in other people's shoes. <laughs> Also found that women feel a sense of competition when it comes to office attire. Do you agree with this? Well, I don't know. All I know is that I am just jealous that these women are going to get raises for wearing skimpy clothes because that was me 10 years ago. Those days are over for me. <laughs> I'm literally a couple years away from wearing a Christmas sweater and showing up on NPR. Oh. <laughs> no, really. no, you know when you start wearing the Christmas sweaters, you're saying to the world it's over. You might as well kill yourself. <laughs> and in fact, if somebody gives you a Christmas sweater as a gift, they are that is considered assisted suicide. <laughs> <laughs> Maureen, yes. this is two-year-old kid, and he's smoking, and the family thinks it's perfectly fine. What do you make of that? Sure, he's really good at it, too. The hand yeah. gestures, the mouth movements. You'd it's... think he was doing it his whole life, and he has. <laughs> <laughs> For the past month, John Gosselin has been dating a much younger woman, a woman, I assume, who doesn't own a television. Okay, so now, is it smart for him to introduce the kids to a girlfriend after a month? First of all, no. the, the kids haven't even met each other yet. There's so many of them. That's true. <laughs> Please welcome the hardworking but disillusioned Maureen Langan. because I deal in reality. I realized my stock was going down, I had to lock in. I understood I had a sale while somebody was still buying. If I look like Bambi over here, I would be whoring around for another 10 years. But I don't, if I don't blow dry this hair, I look like Medusa screwed buckwheat. Bambi, Medusa's the Greek lady with snakes coming out of her head. I got married because I deal in reality. There is a double standard in our society. It doesn't matter how old or ugly a man is. As long as he is famous or wealthy, he will get sex to the day he dies. Women, we have a shelf life of about 35, 40 with good refrigeration. I did not make this up. I learned this from Anna Nicole Smith, my spiritual advisor. Anna was married to an octogenarian in a wheelchair. That's a man in his 80s, Bambi. <laughs> he hadn't walked since Watergate, a political crisis in the 1970s. <laughs> but I know how women can succeed. I've done the work so you don't have to. Killing, killing can help a career. Let me tell you, I watched 60 Minutes. I know what's happening. There's a woman in jail right now because she killed her husband. I don't know her name. Let's just call her Killer. Killer killed her husband because he was battering her. So, you know, he had it coming. She got a prison sentence as she deserved. You know what else she got? Come on. Book and a movie deal. Book and a movie deal. Because she killed her husband. I was an English major. I know how to conjugate verbs. I know how to diagram sentences. I know the proper use of semi-colons. semi effing Colons. <laughs> Separates independent clauses. Those are full sentences. The noun, the verb, the object. <laughs> noun, verb, object. But I can't get a book and a movie deal because I didn't kill anybody. But it's my own fault because I'm the idiot who married a man who respects me. <laughs> Let me tell you something. My father's an alcoholic. Whose isn't? Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Cry me a river. Do you know how many daughters of alcoholics marry abusers and batterers? Any clue? Like 98%. Not me. I couldn't even get that right. <laughs> I got the good guy, the nice guy. Hey, Maureen, can I help you? What can I do? Can I cook? Can I clean? What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? Get off of me. You know what you can do? You can hit me. <laughs> so I can shoot you. <laughs> That's what you can do. I can see the headlines now. Comic kills her husband. She gets a book and movie deal. <laughs> I can dream. I'm Maureen Lang, and you've been a great bunch. Thank you.